Well, the past three am uh, mm, ah well good place to switch drivers so okay and uh, well sphinx he he dozes off uh, himself it looks like she's going for an all-nighter oh yeah good for her uh, well you know that long-winded mental description of Cappadocia uh-huh so yin Oh, look. So feminine. Uh. Oh, so, re so receptive. Uh, so, so oval. Um, you know, enough of that. Look, I have a binary audience that doesn't know what. You're confused occasionally as to your sexual... Yeah. Do you have hair under your arms or not? I know you got one of those flexible faucets, but let's check out the whole thing. Huh? You're, not, you're not just a man or a woman. You're a mixed up DMA chromosome mushed up uh, biological blob that figured out how to walk. A smart monkey you are, huh? Well, um, you're a bitch, bastard. <laughs> bastard bitch? Well, good. You can argue it all on your own, then. Don't have to bum out people on in your neighborhood. Well, look. Okay, let's appeal to the male. The straight male. You know, you got those balls filled up with tortured testosterone and they need to get out, huh? You need, you need Shiva. The destroyer. Slaughter-filled military history of Cappadocia. Oh, yeah, it was fun, huh? With that, well, peaceful times, huh? Smurfs are peaceful, huh? They try to, you know, have fun in life, huh? But those people that, like, wanted to get the Smurfs, yeah, they had an Ottoman wizard to deal with, huh? Well, okay, guys, we're getting out a military game board here. It shows the battlefield of Cappadocia, okay? You've got the Turkish coast with Troy. Anybody remember Helen of Troy? You're the most expensive bitch fuck since Princess Diana, okay? Uh, and Ephesus. <laughs> Pergamon. <sighs> Antioch. You start there, and then you go lump, go lump, go lump. You're starting out in Istanbul. <laughs> Because of the noble lay. Oh, this is the say the Greeks. Oh, in honor of Empire of Constantine. Flipped over to Christianity in 313 AD, of course. Um, yeah, you make it to Troy. Right? Don't need to bring any Trojans with you. Everybody fucks and just... Um, so then you get to... You get to Konya. You get to Rumi's place and the whirling, you know, all those guys. The whirling dervishes is their main headquarters. These were the original bobble dolls of, of Asia. Yeah, a bunch of guys in dresses twirling around to make themselves dizzy. And if you didn't fall on your ass, they called you enlightened. Eh? Oh, the Sufis, huh? Yeah. Well, you got to Konya. Okay, let's get the Look, I know my eyes are beautiful. Look at the game board. Fatima, bring the game board over here. Okay. All right. Okay, there's the game board. Focus on Konya. That's the main staging area before they uh, wipe out the Smurfs. Konya to Cappadocia. How far is it? It's 144. 
miles. You divide that by 12, you get 12 miles between each Kavansari Han with the grouchy camels, huh? Oh, yeah, and a peaceful, you know, merchants going back and forth. Silk Road, everybody making a bit, a lot of money, you know. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, and you, you know, okay, you can see the, the, the hole, like from a distance. That's why we have game boards, huh? The pretend you're God sitting up in the space station, huh? Or you bought a ticket on Virgin Atlantic? Or Jeff Bezos just blew your ass up to 62 miles. Yeah, it only cost a half a million bucks to float in space for three minutes. I'm wondering who. I mean, I booked a ticket, the lottery, because I want to be the first human to be stoned to the gills on LSD when I get my ass. I'll be able to write a good story about that. Well, why is the Anatoly... Guys, okay. Get, yeah, we got the hippie millennials gone. Now we got the, we got the sort of hillbilly uh, beer drinking uh, my neighbors here. Um, war. <laughs> war Channel? Why is it so forlorn? Well... You got a bunch of anachronistic, uptight, conservative, Islamic fundamentalists everywhere. Nobody can get laid. No sex. No, you know. Um, except, oh, look at them go down the, the hashish chair. Oh, the fucking hip is there. Yeah. Okay. Focus. Game board. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Um, Napoleon wannabes. Yeah. In the thirteenth century. Anthropologist. When was it? Thirteenth century. The Seljuk Turks, not the Ottoman Turks. They built a series of Karansari stops along here. They're called Hans. H-A-N-S. Easy to spell. Easy to say. Hans. Not like Karansari. Oh. Uh, so, the sultan along here, huh? he said, look. Look at all these camels galumphing, galumphing. If I made them camel hotels... Um, I could make a lot of money, huh? Because I'd tax them, huh? I mean, uh, so he did. He built these Hans. And what are Hans? Hans? They're like forts for overnight camel merchants. So the other tribes, so the Baluchis don't sneak up on them in the night. And, um... Yeah, they have water wells. They have, you know, they're paying a lot for this, okay? So they have huge wells that go really deep. And the sultan, he has full-time artisans there. You know, a dead goat falls in your well, you got to get it out. Um, and bakers. Uh, yeah, you want to, you know, you've been 12 miles all day, huh? You want a croissant almondine to go with that uh, chai, huh? Bakers, uh, he had dentists. Well, for the camels, huh? You know, camels, grouchy enough, huh? Just straight, huh? A camel with a toothache? Give me a break, huh? You got one of those, huh? Nobody sleeps that whole night. You got to march 24 miles with no sleep. That's not fun, and you're getting paid so few turkeys lira, you wonder, what the fuck? How did your uncle talk you into this shit? We gotta talk. Have you ever slept with a camel? 
grew up on a farm, huh? sheep, camels, um, goats, huh? With a toothache? Yeah, bum you out all night, huh? They had camel therapists. Because camels got addicted to Turkish tobacco. They used to mellow them out by like, you know, sucky sucky up on the, on the Turkish tobacco, huh? Well, after a while, they're trying to conserve water. They got those wells. Camels just drink a lot of water. This wasn't really an efficient road vehicle. Took a lot of petrol of water. Well, camel therapy. They smoke too many camel cigarettes. It's hard to, to, to come off those, huh? No filters. No warning label. Well, Sultan, quit pushing the cigarettes. We'll smoke hash, okay? Remember where you came from? A little bit of history here? Oh. Put the cigarettes down, camels. <laughs> you know, have a good night's sleep.